We've all been told that fruit is good for us, so it makes sense that more fruit would be even better, right? But what if that was all we ate? Would it make you a healthier person? This is your body on only eating fruit for one year. Believe it or not, eating only fruit is a thing. It's known as the fruitarian diet. Apple co-founder Steve Jobs was a fruitarian. He believed eating a diet primarily composed of fruit would cleanse his body of harmful fluids. Was he right? Or would eating only fruit send you to the doctor? Most fruit-only diets are actually mostly fruit diets, as they usually include some nuts, seeds, and vegetables. But for this challenge, we're going full-on only fruit. So let's get started. The new diet starts well. You enjoy all kinds of fruit, so there's no problem finding variety, but you should be careful with your choices. A lot of fruit is very high in sugar, so you may want to limit the amount of lychee, mango, cherries, and grapes you eat. Bananas are also very high in sugar, but they're a good source of potassium, so enjoy them in moderation. Blueberries are high in fiber, antioxidants, and vitamins C and K, making them an excellent choice. Watermelon will keep you hydrated and provide a wide variety of nutrients, and apples will give you much needed fiber and antioxidants. Okay, you've now settled into a regular diet and things seem to be going well, but that wasn't the case for actor Ashton Kutcher. While preparing for his movie role as Steve Jobs, he tried the all fruit diet one month in and he was rushed to the hospital in severe pain. Thankfully, you haven't had any problems to date. As much as you enjoy the fruit you've been eating, you've started to crave other things, particularly high-carb foods like bread, potatoes, and pasta. And you've noticed your visits to the restroom have become much more frequent as all that fiber works its way through your body. Halfway through the year, and although you've become used to your new diet, those cravings are getting worse. You find that you're getting tired quickly and are often lightheaded and dizzy. You're malnourished and you aren't getting the nutrients you need. To combat this, you need to supplement your diet with vitamins and protein powders. Be sure to drink lots of water to keep hydrated. It will also help digest all that sugar. Chances are that by this point, you've had to deal with some adverse health effects. If not, consider yourself lucky, but be ready. They're coming soon. Your digestive system is a mess. All that fiber is wreaking havoc with your innards. You feel bloated and have cramps. You often feel sick and tired as your blood sugar levels are out of whack. And you've lost a lot of weight, which may have been your goal in the first place. However, it's not just fat you're losing. You're not getting the nutrients you need to maintain your muscles. All this fruit is overworking your pancreas, so it's beginning to fail. Although there's no evidence that his fruitarian diet played any role, Steve Jobs died of pancreatic cancer. If you've stuck to a strict diet of only fruit for the last 12 months, you're either in the hospital or in very serious condition. Or you're dead. If you are still breathing, you would be deficient in many essential vitamins and minerals. As good as fruit is for you, it doesn't provide everything your body needs. It lacks complete proteins and amino acids needed to build muscles. Those people who do follow a fruitarian diet typically follow diets that are no more than 90% fruit. Although it doesn't seem like much, that 10% of veggies and carbs makes all the difference. Moderation and balance are key. Eating a diet rich in fruits and vegetables can help reduce the risk of many leading causes of illness, including heart disease, diabetes, and some cancers, but it's also important not to ignore the other food groups. Now that you've survived 12 months of only fruit, 
you're probably looking forward to enjoying something other than an apple. Well, we've got what you need. How about Mountain Dew? That's it. You can only drink Mountain Dew. That's your next challenge on another episode of Your Body On.